Hi, welcome back to Kyler B Music and Reviews. Another week, another video. This week we have a Jackson. This is a Kelly edition. Um, I'm assuming this is maybe mid-level. Uh, it does have active pickups in it. Um, this one, somebody's dropped it here on the corner because it does have a ding there. There's a couple of scratches right here on the side. But beyond that, it isn't in that bad a shape. Um, everything works. There's no, you know, noises or anything in the switch, which is really odd. Um, for a guitar, it's probably been beat up or played till the end of time here. Um, there's not a whole lot of fret wear to this. It might might need a little bit of a crown, but it isn't that bad. Um, there's not, you know, really a whole lot of wear to the, the frets. Um, this is a bolt-on neck. It isn't like some of the $2,000 ones where you got a neck through design. This was made in India. This is a 2007, for those of you that were interested in the year of it. Um, again, there's that one ding there that somebody <laughs> dropped it somewhere. Uh, there's no cracks or anything in the pocket, which is always what I look for. Make sure that it's not broken in the neck or been dropped that way, of course. No necks or neck breaks or anything like that. There's no cracks or anything up in here. Again, this was made in India. Um, it isn't one of the real early ones that were made in Japan or anything like that, um, or America for that matter. Um, I did change the strings on it, but I didn't do any adjustments or anything to it whatsoever. So what you hear is the way it was when I picked it up. Um, strings are pretty close. So, and this neck was straight. So as long as you got that, you got a decent start. So, so I'm going to torment you with a little bit of demo on it, and I'll see you on the other side.
was the Kelly? I think it's a decent guitar. I, I'm an explorer guy. I like explorers, so you know this kind of this design is attractive to me. I'm not particular to black because um, it shows every stinking scratch and everything else. But they're using a poly coat on their on their paint anyway, so it, you can go like this, and you're not really going to scratch it unless you really dig into it. Um, again, there's that one ding in the corner there. Um, other than that. I think it's a great guitar. I, I do like the active pickups. You just can't, don't dare leave that plugged in because you'll run the battery down. But beyond that, there isn't much else to say on this. They've seen these use 300 bucks, 200 bucks, depending on the shape it's in. Um, if it's beat up a little bit, I wouldn't give much more than maybe 250 for these. Um, that just play the heck out of them. But I hope you enjoyed the video. I appreciate you stopping by. Hope to see you again next week. If you want to, hit the like and share. You don't have to. Nobody is really anyway, but it doesn't matter. Um, I'll see you again next week. I'm Kyle B. Take care.